Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to my channel. As you guessed by the um, subtitles, this is going to be a TJ Maxx and Marshalls haul. I'm so excited because I've been wanting to do this for a while and I feel like every time I've gone into a TJ Maxx or Marshalls lately, it's been an absolute bust. So it wasn't even worth like buying anything or like maybe I bought like one or two things. But this time I actually found quite a bit of stuff. Um, more so Marshalls and TJ Maxx. Um, and I'll explain why there was tons of stuff at both. Um, this is going to be everything from makeup to skincare to home goods to tons of stuff, fun, fun stuff. And I'll tell you everything I bought and how much money I saved. So if you want to see what I found at TJ Maxx and Marshalls, then just keep watching. Okay. So I want to show you the bags. They look small, but I promise you there's lots of fun stuff in these things. So I'm going to start at TJ Maxx with what I got. And everything I got at TJ Maxx is like beauty related. So it's like skincare, makeup. Um, so the first thing that I got was the H2O Beauty Water Bright Color Correcting Sleep Mask. Um, I have used a moisturizer by this brand before and I loved it. So when I saw this for um, $7.99, I was like, okay, yes, ma'am. Because I love sleeping masks. Like it's one of my favorite things to do is do my skincare, cleanse my face, get everything gone, and then slather on a good sleeping mask, go to sleep and wake up and feel super refreshed. Uh, so online, this one I think was $48, marked down to $24, and then at TJ Maxx it's $7.99. They had a couple of them too, so if you're looking for a good color correcting, moisturizing skin mask, check out TJ Maxx because they might have more of yours. Um, the next, and I know this sounds like super bougie, but I love Marc Jacobs makeup. I found a Marc Jacobs brush. Are you kidding me? This is still in Sephora for $38 and I paid $9.99. I don't even know if you can see that. $9.99. That's insane. So this is the liquid foundation brush. Um, and I'm really excited because like I use my powder foundation, which is all I'm wearing right now, um, is a Marc Jacobs brush and so are most of my brushes because I, I find them cheap. Um, so I was super excited to find this one because I did not have this one, but when I'd use the Dior face and body, um, I would love a foundation brush, so super soft, um, and it just feels so, like, just feels luxurious, so $9.99, it was at Sephora for $38, so score. Next thing I found is something else that's still on the shelves at Sephora is the Maraud Energizing Essential C Cleanser, so it is a vitamin C face cleanser, and this is really cool because, um, like I love to do vitamin C cleansers or like my vitamin C serum in the morning because it just gives your skin like a brightening effect, I guess. And overall, like over time, it really does help brighten your skin and even your skin tone. Um, but to find the Maraud cleanser that has vitamin C, so clutch. This is still in Sephora. It's a little bit bigger. The one at Sephora is 6.5 ounces and this one's 4.5. But at Sephora, it was like 30, 32. And this is... $7.99 at TJ Maxx. So for $7.99, you get 4.5 fluid ounces of the vitamin C cleanser. And it's got the little beads. So if you've ever used, what is it, the Neutrogena like morning burst face wash, then this is basically it, but it's much better for your skin. Marad is a great skincare brand. I use their um, sunscreen and I love it. So I was super excited to find this because I really needed a new cleanser anyways. Um, so for $7.99, hello. The last thing that I found at TJ Maxx is a Buxom Bold Gel Lipstick. And I've actually never tried Buxom's lipsticks. I love their lip pumping glosses. Their lip pumping glosses are my favorite. Um, but I was watching Paige and Isabel, I believe, on YouTube. And both of them rave about the shade White Russian from Buxom. Um, so when I found the matte version of the White Russian gel lipstick, I was like, okay, I have to have this. So I'm going to swatch it for you. And it's just a really pretty, like, pinky nude color. I don't know if you can really, like, tell. Um, but it's so pretty. Um, it feels really good in your skin. And I love the tops, too, because, like, look, they're, like, magnetic. So, so neat. Um, and this was... $5.99 and these are at Sephora for $22 I believe um so Marshalls I found a ton of stuff I was so excited because I hardly ever go on Marshalls because I usually just hit up TJ Maxx and I'm like all right I'm done like spent too much money so 
but like I said, lately I haven't. So I was like, I'm just gonna go to Marshall's just to see. And I hit the jackpot. Um, so I'll start with the non-beauty first. Um, the Ray Dunn craze. I'm not super crazy about it, but my mom and my mother-in-law love Ray Dunn. I don't know what it is about it, but they have Ray Dunn everything. They've got the canisters, the serving platters, the coffee mugs, the everything. Um, and over time, like I've collected some of it because like they just buy it for me and it goes cute in my kitchen. And we're actually building a house right now. So it's going to be really cool in the new kitchen. So whatever. Anyways, I found a notepad, which I keep a notepad in my purse with me everywhere I go. And this one is super thin and it was, I think $4.99. Um, and I don't know how much these usually retail for because I don't know where Rado is normally sold. Um, and then I also, these are all three Rado items. All three Ray Dunn items, so I promise I'm not a crazy Ray Dunn person, but I saw this and I had to have it because, I mean, hello, I feel like a super mom sometimes. Like, sometimes I feel like I fail as a mom, and then sometimes I'm like, yes, like, I did that by myself, yes. Um, and the coffee mugs at TJ Maxx were all $5.99, which for a really good, like, ceramic coffee mug, I feel like it's a, it's a total steal. And then the last Ray Dunn item I got, and I actually got this from my mother-in-law, and I don't know if she's going to take it because she said she has one. So, but it is a calendar, like a planner, and it goes from August 19 to July 2020. So usually when you find planners at like TJ Maxx and stuff, they're already like halfway through the year. And when I saw this one and it was like starting next month, I was like, oh, okay, hi, like I'll take you. And it was $12.99. So you open it up and it's got like the cute little tabs and it's got sections to like make notes and all kinds of cool stuff. So I thought this was a cute little thing. So if you're looking for like a gift, I mean, maybe for even somebody that's like starting college soon, this would be a super cute gift because I would have used this in college for sure. And it's best year ever. So we're gonna have a good year. It's so funny that I found this. It is a plush spa headband by the cream shop and this is super cool i'll open it and show you so you can put this on and it basically pulls all your hair back so when you're doing like your skin clear skin care gosh, i'm so tongue-tied today i can't talk um your skincare routine it just keeps all your hair back and it keeps your hair from getting wet um and hello it's super cute it's pink and it has like little hearts on it so when i found it for 4.99 compared to i think it was like ten dollars on amazon i was like okay cool i'll save five bucks and have it right now instead of waiting two days um so yeah super cute and it fits like it stretches pretty big so i mean if you have like a big head or a small head i feel like it's still gonna fit you um so that was pretty cool the next thing i found and this was on clearance um is a japanesque angled blush brush and i needed a new blush brush so and i have a japanesque like all over face brush that i love so when I found this on clearance for $4, I was like, hi, hello, you're going home with me. Um, so it's super soft and feels so good. And it's like the perfect size to get just like the right amount of blush on your face so you're not like overwhelmingly flushed. Um, so yeah, so if you ever need like good cheap makeup brushes and you find the Japanesque brushes at TJ Maxx, I love them and I think they're really good quality for the price that you pay. So the last three things that I found are still makeup. Um, back to Buxom, these are their top coat glosses and they're lip plumping. So this one is in the shade Mariah, I think. Yeah, and it is so pretty. I saw this and I was like, oh my gosh, please don't be swatched. Please don't be swatched because you guys have to be careful with like makeup at TJ Maxx. You have to open it and like examine it and you wait for that sound. So until you hear that sound, don't buy it, especially not a lip gloss or a lipstick because even though you can sanitize them, like, no, I'm sorry. If, if it's been on somebody's mouth or their hand, like, it's not going home with me. So, it's just a really pretty, like, iridescent, like, shimmery color. You can kind of tell. It just, like, picks up, like, some pink reflex. So, I'll go ahead and put that on, actually. Um, and they, mm, they smell so good. And they give you not like an overwhelming tingle, but like a good like plumping tingle. So, oh, and this was $5.99 and I think these are at Sephora for like $22, $18, $22, I don't know. And then another lip product I found, which I was shocked about because hello, it's Marc Jacobs again, was a Marc Jacobs nude 
sheer gel lipstick have to have that one because hello it's so pretty so it's just a nude pink color and so pretty so it's like a light color so it's not like overwhelmingly colorful but it's just enough to give your lips just a little pop of color the packaging is so cute so just looks luxurious feels luxurious and like hello it's Marc Jacobs so and that's in the shade understudy it's like 114 understudy and last but not least I needed a new blush like I have been looking for powder blush I've been loving the Glossier um cloud paint but I wanted just like a dipped brush or a dipped blush um this is the Too Faced Love Flush long lasting 16 hour blush and these have such good reviews on Sephora this has been a like a long time uh best-selling item that Too Faced has but it's so cute it comes in like a little heart container and when you open it it has a mirror so it's pretty cool this is in the shade love hangover um and i'm gonna swatch it because i actually did not swatch it in the store oh my god love 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 so it's really bright pink i don't know if you can tell but it has like a slight shimmer <sighs> so if you were to use like a light hand and just like a well, i have a blush brush let's try it <laughs> So I'm just gonna like tap in just a little bit, knock off any excess and throw it on. So it just gave me like a little, little bit of color, which is what I like for my blush. I don't like a lot, I love this brush. It feels so good. So yeah, so I think this was $10.99 and these are still in Ulta and Sephora for I think like $20. $28 I think these are expensive like their blushes are so expensive but they last forever like once you put them on your skin like they do not come off so um so yeah all in all that was probably the best TJ Maxx Marshalls trip I've ever taken and I was so excited so let me get, let me know if you guys like these kinds of videos because if so then I will start doing something like this where I go like maybe once a month um and just maybe shop along with you like i'll show you what's on the shelf instead of like buying it and bringing it home which i mean i'll still show you what i buy and bring home but maybe sometimes i don't always buy and bring stuff home um but i would love to start doing that if you would like to see that so if that's something you'd like to see let me know in the comments um and if you've ever tried any of these products like let me know in the comments what you think about them or if you've seen them at your tj maxx and if you've seen them, then let me know where you're at so I can like share it with everybody else. So yeah, that's it for this video. So I hope you guys liked it. Thanks so much.